Hey everybody, Mr. Sharky here um, with another demonstration for you. Um, what we have here is a tool called a manometer. Uh, and, and what we have set up, just to walk you through it real quick, I've got this glass tube which is open on the top, so there is air that is down in this tube. Um, I've got my Erlenmeyer flask with a, uh, set up with a syringe uh, coming off the sidearm. Uh, so I have some air that is in my flask, I have some air that is in this syringe, um, and then I've got this layer of water, which does a, kind of an interesting thing uh, because I have the air up top and then the air in my syringe and my flask are separated by this, uh, by this layer of water. Uh, so what I'm going to do real quick is uh, I'm going to push down on this syringe and we want you all to observe what happens um, inside my manometer. Uh, so as I press down on the syringe, the big thing we should be noticing is that this water level seems to rise. Uh, the, the water is, it seems like it's getting pushed up uh, into my glass tube. If I pull back out on my syringe, we'll see that the water level starts to go back down again. Um, what we'd like you to do is to pull out a, a scratch piece of paper and try to draw a particle diagram that helps explain what's happening. Why does the water level rise as I push my syringe in? Why does the water level fall as I push as I pull my syringe back out?